It's simple to be model loyal to the moon. We've solely acquired the one, in spite of everything, not like Jupiter and Saturn, the place you'd have dozens to select from. Here, it's Luna or Nada, or not. The reality is, there's one other sorta, kinda moon in a sorta, kinda orbit. Round Earth that was found solely in 2016. And in keeping with a new study in nature, we might finally know the way it was shaped. The quasi moon, named Kamoalewa, after a Hawaiian phrase that refers to a transferring celestial object, shouldn't be a lot to talk of, measuring lower than 50 meters, 164 feet, throughout. It circles the Earth in a repeating corkscrew like trajectory that brings it no nearer than 40 to 100 instances the 384,000 kilometers, 239,000 miles distance of our extra acquainted moon. Its odd flight path is brought on by the competing gravitational pulls of the Earth and the solar, which frequently bend and torque the moonlet's motions, stopping it from reaching an extra standard orbit. It's primarily influenced just by the sun's gravity, but this pattern shows up because it's also, but not quite, on an Earth-like orbit. So it's this sort of odd dance, says graduate scholar Ben Sharkey of the Lunar and Planetary Laboratory on the University of Arizona, the lead writer of the paper. None of which means that Kamoilewa has to have particularly unique origins. The photovoltaic system is affected by asteroids, a few of that are captured by the gravity of different planets and change into extra standard, if fragmentary, moons. Others don't orbit different planets within the widespread approach however. Fall into line in entrance of them or behind them and tempo them of their orbits across the solar. Just like the flocks of so-called Trojan asteroids that precede and path Jupiter. Either approach. Kamoalewa was certain to get consideration as a result of its composition post a cust. Thriller. Asteroids are inclined to mirror brightly in sure infrared frequencies, however. Kamoalewa simply doesn't. It's dimmer by some means, clearly made of various stuff, which suggests a totally different origin. To examine the thriller, Sharkey, below the steering of his PhD advisor, planetary scientist Vishnu Reddy, first turned to a NASA-run telescope in Hawaii routinely used for finding out Earth-vicinity asteroids. But even by the often dependable instrument, the infrared signature appeared too faint. Instead, they switched to a University of Arizona-run monocular telescope that, as Sharkey says, may squeeze every last ounce of photons out of that object. That produced higher, clearer outcomes, however nonetheless they had been incomplete. The rock was product of widespread silicates like different asteroids, however they had been widespread solely of their normal composition, not of their infrared signature, which remained stubbornly off. At final, the reply advised itself. If Kamoalewa was behaving like a form of quasi-moon, maybe it was an artifact of the particular moon. Earlier in Sharkey's PhD program, one in every of his advisors printed a paper on lunar samples introduced again by the Apollo 14 mission in 1971. When Sharkey in contrast the information he was getting in his telescope with what the sooner geologists got here up with within the rock lab, the outcomes matched completely. The type of space weathering lunar silicates endure after they're nonetheless on the floor of the moon exactly accounted for the variations within the infrared reflectivity between widespread asteroids and Kamoalewa. Visually, what you're seeing is weathered silicate, says Sharkey. The eons of exposure to space environment and the micrometeorite impacts, it's almost like a fingerprint and it's hard to miss. How Kamoalewa shook freed from our lunar companion isn't any thriller.
The moon's been getting bombarded by area rocks for billions of years. Leading to all method of lunar particles getting ejected into area, almost 500 bits of which have made it to the floor of the Earth as meteorites. Kamoalewa is one such piece of lunar rubble that spiraled away from the moon, but moderately than touchdown on Earth or just tumbling off into the void, it discovered itself a quasi-satellite in its personal proper. We see thousands of craters on the moon. So some of this lunar ejecta has to be sticking around in space, says Sharkey. Kamoalewa gained its stick round all that lengthy, as its present trajectory shouldn't be totally secure. According to estimates from Sharkey and others, the article will stay an earthly companion for less than about 300 extra years, nothing in any respect on the cosmic clock after which it should break freed from its present gravitational chains and twirl off into the void. Originally a a part of the moon, then a companion of Earth, it should spend the remainder of its lengthy life touring by itself.